Hey, what's up guys? Diamond Gamer Pro here today, back again with another video. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you all how to install Game Boy Color games onto your Nintendo 3DS or 2DS. What you're going to need for today's video is, of course, your 3DS or 2DS. You're going to also need it to be modded. If you guys do not have a modded one or don't know how to mod it, I will leave a link in the description below for a written guide on how to mod your 3DS. And finally, you are going to need a computer because that's what we're going to be creating the installable formats on. So, what you're going to want to do is unplug your SD card, plug it into your computer, and let's jump right into it. Alrighty, now I've got my SD card plugged into my computer, and I'm going. And what you guys are going to want to do is head to the link in the description below. That is going to bring you to this website right here for the new Super Ultimate Injector. This is actually what we use to import Game Boy games onto a 3DS or 2DS, and then you're going to be doing the exact same thing for Game Boy Color games. So you're just going to want to download the program, and once you do, it's going to come in a zip file, and it's going to look just like this. I have everything already unzipped, and you have language settings, because I'm pretty sure the default is Spanish. But if you guys want to change it to English or French, and I believe there's Russian in there as well, you can just change it to whatever you'd like. And then what you're going to want to do is open up the program. It's the exe file. I already have it opened right here. And what you're going to want to do is just press File, New, and Game Boy Color CIA. Because CIAs are the installable format for the Nintendo 3DS and 2DS. So once you have this here, you're going to have a blank screen with not many options because everything is blank. What you're going to want to do is find the ROM you're going to be using. For today's video, I'm going to be using Super Mario Bros. Deluxe. It's a .gbc. Simply drag and drop it into the program and give it a second. It should load up all the files you need right away. So you guys can see we already have everything here. And then we're going to download the title screen for this. I like to do the title screen or the box art. I prefer the box art for the game icon. And then I use the title screen for up here. So it'll look just like this. You can choose to fit by width, fit by height. For these ones, I'm pretty sure they both just fit automatically. And then there you go. You already have this set up. There are also other functions. So you can do a 3D frame like the Game Boy Advance. You could do just an image. I don't know why you'd ever want to do that. I prefer this one. I think it looks great, and it looks like an official Game Boy Color virtual console game. You can scroll down. There's options. I always do GBC virtual console. That's definitely the one you should always be doing. And then there's a couple, like, you can change the settings here. Like, these are the button mappings. I don't actually know if you can change them. Can you? I don't know. Regardless, I'm going to be keeping them the same because these are the ways that they should be doing it. And then once you're done, just go to up here and press Project, and then Export CIA. Then you're going to want to go to your PC and then inside my PC I'm going to scroll down and I'm going to see my USB drive that's my SD card it's just in a USB adapter go to the CIA's file and press save it's going to take a second there and once it is done you guys will be able to see that it saves perfectly to my SD card and once it does we're going to put my SD card back into my DS and I will show you guys what to do from there after this finishes saving and there we go so I'm going to pop back over to my DS and show you guys what to do there Alrighty, so once you finish that process and have reinserted your SD card, go ahead and power on your 3DS or 2DS and you're going to want to launch the FBI application. So I'm opening up the FBI application right now, you saw it also on the home screen, and for those of you who are not new to modding your DS, you'll know what it is. Once you're inside, simply go to the SD section, scroll down to CIAs, find the CIA that you're going to install, press install and delete, press A. And then it's going to do the installation process. This should be very quick because Game Boy Color games are very small. Once you're done, just press OK. Go back and press Start. This will bring you back to your home menu. And you guys will see now that I will have new software added to my home menu. We're going to unwrap it right here. And you guys can see that it is, in fact, Super Mario Bros. Deluxe, the icon we chose. And just looking at the way we want it. So I'm going to open up the application to show you guys that it does, in fact, work perfectly as a virtual console game. You guys can see it looks just like the Game Boy Color virtual console games. And once we boot it up, there we go. It works absolutely perfectly. So I hope you guys did enjoy today's video. If you did, be sure to leave a like, comment down below what other consoles you guys would like to see on your Nintendo 3DS or 2DS. Thanks for all for watching. Peace out.